Here's something you may not have known. It seems the city of Corpus Christi has been operating an RV park at Lake Corpus Christi since 2008. Top city officials now believe the venture is losing money, and so they are now trying to find a way to turn things around. Our Michael Gibson has that story. City Manager Peter Zanoni says he and other staff members, along with some council members, plan on heading up to Sunrise Beach at Lake Corpus Christi to take a look at the property and see exactly what's been going on. One thing we want to do is have great city facilities, whether it's an RV park or park. Uh, but two, we want to make sure we're getting the right rate when we lease something out. Uh, we don't want to waste money and abuse ratepayers' monies. Councilman Greg Smith owns the Pioneer RV Park in Port Aransas and is going to try and help with figuring out a solution as to whether the city should continue running an RV park out at Lake Corpus Christi or whether it should try and find a private company to run the place. People are staying there in the long time, and, and for the city of Corpus Christi, is that our charge is to provide a, a mobile home type park for long-term housing with it and that, that's something we need to discuss with city management and council and that's what that park has turned out to be. We came out here to Lake Corpus Christi at Sunrise Beach to talk with some of the people here about this controversy and almost immediately we found somebody who had decided to leave the place on a permanent basis. We've been staying here over the last seven years we come every summer. Actually, there's a trader bounce to a friend that's moving out because the rent just got way too high here. So she's moving somewhere else. Now, beginning on February the 1st, the RV park is raising its rates. Here are the new prices compared to the current ones. You can see there's a $75 weekly jump and a $100 monthly increase. We really got to make sure the business that we're in is a, is a campground for entertainment and enjoy the beach and not just an inexpensive uh, residential setting for year-round operation year after year after year. The city manager believes that by March 10th he'll have all the information he needs to go back to city council so it can then decide if it wants to stay in the RV park business or turn it over to someone else who can make it a profitable venture. From Lake Corpus Christi, Michael Gibson, 3 News.